Hello and welcome back guys. So today, I'm going to do something different. So, I'm going to compare the Joy Toy Flying Cavalry Type A, Type B, and Type C. I will show you guys what are the difference between the three. So, before we start, if you want a Joy Toy of your own, link for Habitoys Laguna is down there in the description. And I just want to make a big shout out and a big thanks to Sir Ed for sending me all of this figure so that I could review it for you guys. So here are the packaging for the type A, B, and C. So as you can see from the side, they are identical. I love what they did with the box. So here are the front. So as you can see, all of their uh, all of the armors. So I really do love what they did with the box. Joy Toy really did improve in terms of packaging with their figures. So here are the back side. Okay, so I guess that is enough for the box and let's get the figure in here. So here are the figures. We have the Type A, Type B, and Type C. Now since this is a mass-produced toy, we could expect that parts are going to be reused and going to be repainted in order for them to produce a different toy. Now, in some cases from this figure, that is true. But, for the most parts, they are different. You can see that their head sculpt, they are all different. Now, I think the reused parts would have been the body area, the hands, and the foot. As for the main figure, I think those are the reused and repainted parts. But other than that, these are pretty much different figure. They are all sculpted differently, painted differently, and molded differently. So let me get a close-up shot so that I can show it to you guys. Okay, so from this shot, you can clearly see that the armored parts in their arms, they are all different. They are not being reused. So we have the Type A, Type B, and the Type C. So here is a close-up shot of the lower body. So at first, I thought that the Type B have the same lower leg armor as the Type A. But upon close-up inspection of the figure, they are different. So we have here the armor for the Type A. Even their knee armor, they are different. So Type A, Type B, and the Type C. So the Type C is the most different one. You can see that the Type C doesn't have any lower leg armor. Okay, so here are some back shots. So as you can see, the main body, they are the same. It is just painted in a different color scheme. Now, the waist bag or the waist armor, they are all different. You can see it right there. So for the accessories, so let's start off with the pistol. So as you can see, the Type A pretty much have the different pistol, but the Type B and the Type C, they are quite identical. So you can see it right here. And then here are their assault rifle. So as you can see, all of all of the figure pretty much have the same assault rifle. So here is another part that they are different from each other. Their helmets. So we have the helmet for the type A, the type B, and the type C. So as you can see, all of them are different from each other and they are all painted and detailed quite nicely. And then here is the most identical one. They all have the same jetpack. As you can see it right here. There are no difference between the three. And I guess that is about it for our comparison video of the Joy Toy Flying Cavalry Type A, B, and C. And I have to be honest, I was quite impressed with this figure. They are small but they are quite detailed. And I have to admit, I have a lot of fun playing with the figures and taking pictures of the figures. So here are some of my shots which are inspired from Titanfall since I do enjoy playing Titanfall. <laughs> so as you can see, the figure looks pretty great and they are fun to take pictures of. So yep, I think you are going to enjoy these figures and they are pretty much worth your money. I guess that is about it. I hope you guys like this video and if you do so, please consider hitting the thumbs up button and if you want to support this channel, consider subscribing. Thank you all for watching, stay safe, and I'll see you on the next one.